Libra, Libra, the balancing act of the horoscope. Hi, this is Adrian from Red Lintel Healing doing our July horoscope using our Chakra Insight Oracle, a card for self-health recommendations using the Sacred Self-Care Oracle, and then getting your, mess your power message using the Crystal Power Tarot. <music> Happy fall, babies. Let's take a look and get an idea of two era areas in your energetic health where you will need to probably take a little extra care, a little attention to you for the month of July. So the first card we have is our base chakra, our root chakra. This is our house of family. This is also our house of um, finances, also our house of community. And then just also our house of connection to Mama Earth. How grounded are we? How secure do we feel with our finances? How secure do we feel with our place on Earth and who we are? And most importantly, um, how is our family life? How is the situation going at home? So this is calling us to really just take a general look at our place and how, we're, how secure we're feeling in the world that is the whole point of the base chakra it is about security and connection okay so making sure tying up any loose ends and taking whatever steps you need to take to make sure that you feel secure remind yourself that you are connected and grounded to earth and you are secure because your feet are securely planted on the ground you are completely connected to mama earth so use that mantra during the month of july to bring you back to ground to self to make sure that you are staying connected through your root chakra then your next card is the throat chakra your ability to speak and hear divine truth what messages are you giving to the universe and to your friends and family about who you are and your message and your purpose here on earth that is what your throat chakra is all about making sure that you're speaking divine truth at all times. Also listening to divine truth as well. The throat chakra is not so much about speaking as it also is about listening. Sometimes we need to make sure that we're taking time to listen, not only to everything else, but listen to ourselves. Are things that we're telling ourselves not resonating with our throat chakra? Are we telling lies about ourselves are we putting ourselves down in any way that doesn't resonate with who we are and who we came to be on mama earth so make sure you you keep note of that during the month of july libra what messages are you speaking to yourself and how are you listening to them through your throat chakra all right my beautiful libra so let's take a look and see what area of our beautiful sacred self-care we need to pay attention to and take care of for the month of july and we are getting again the card again i mean got this because we got this for um leos let's take a look at our abundance planning which also ties into the base chakra if you're feeling worried about finances anything that you don't feel secure with in regards to finances and security through your base chakra, the best way to take advantage to feel more secure about that is sitting down and looking at your finances. Do some abundance planning. Where do I need to put more attention with my finances? Am I overspending in some areas? Are there other areas where I need to be saving or can be pulling back a little bit? That's the best way when you're in a fearful place or you're not feeling secure is to take a step back and plan to make sure you feel more secure going forward, okay? And then last but not least, let's get our message for our Crystal Power Tarot. And this message is, hold on a second. Let me shuffle again. Okay, this is the Page of Pentacles. I am open to opportunities for personal growth. I am open to opportunities for personal growth. So again, taking a look at your root chakra, where do I not feel connected? How do I not, what areas am I not feeling secure? And going through and making 
plans and taking action through your abundance planning to make sure that you feel more secure. Using your throat chakra to speak divine truth and listen to the divine messages that you're speaking about yourself. Anything that you say that doesn't resonate with who you are, throw it in the trash. Say something else. Get back to speaking and listening to divine truth. And then your action for the month is being open for personal growth. Hey, maybe we should go try out this new yoga video. Maybe that'll help us with our personal growth. Okay, I know that was a wild thought, but hey, Libras, try it. Okay, so that's your message and your for the month of July. Again, make sure you're taking care of yourself and spending that time you need to make sure that you feel secure in everything that you do on Earth. Until the next video for for August, you guys, make sure you're taking care of yourselves. Bye. Mm-hmm.